Father, we thank the Lord, sit down for his mighty word. <clears throat> and when we hear about um, the strong man, amen. God's strong, um, God's man for the strong man and God's woman for the strong man. Um, there's an area that many times we miss is that many times when we hear a um, sermon like this, it's for the future. We only understand most of the past. In 2020 and 21, the body of Christ discovered that they were not ready for the future strong man. Because when the future strong man came, as infirmity struck the world, and then the beast hijacked the infirmity and introduced what they always wanted to introduce to mankind did you know that during the intensity of the pandemic he made a public statement that this is the time for us to do to mankind all we wanted to do all this time and some folks they tried to be oblivious and and tried to behave as if they don't remember those things and and when i tried to guide them in the church and try to deliver them and try to break the stronghold of them they run right back into the mouth of the beast he was like the only prime minister who said that he said this i've been studying about the beast from 40 years ago and from that time we know that they are waiting and wanting to come upon the earth that once that thing come upon the earth they will do all they wanted to do because they said it's going to be hard to find another opportunity to do that to mankind thank god those of you in the church who have made that wrong step have been delivered and if if you made that step and took the thing don't worry don't worry don't run off to church that believe that it's okay are you there don't worry you have been delivered how do i know second timothy 4 verse 18 he said the lord shall deliver me from every evil work oh my god you better get that verse for yourself god can't lie no matter what they put in us it can't stay some folk gone after some church that pamper them and say what you did was good and you'll be all right and then they begin to pay and fight against those who try to help them my god you can't fight against a doctor come on them unwise people fight against a doctor well god is a spiritual doctor are you there glory to god glory to god hallelujah so here's my point guess what happened bad news they are coming again so you don't want to hear nothing come on they are coming again but watch this now the one that they brought this first time the first time people get sick people died people get stroke come on people can't move their foot again all kind of bad things happen no i'm uh, my God, hope I can handle me right now. The one that is coming, you're going to make your seat better? You're going to make your foot work better? Come on, somebody. You're going to make you have more money? Come on. You're going to make you feel better? You're going to do everything good for you. Are you with me, somebody? But it is from the devil. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Did you hear what I said? Get ready. That's why God, any time a man servant preach like this, Come on, you better take it prophetically. Come, most of what he talk about, you conquer already. Come on, <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come mm on, -hmm. minister. Come on, nobody can get you to to, to come to adultery again. Come on, come on, they mad. They can come on, smoke cigarette, I smoke marijuana. Come on, they mad. You tell them get out of my face. Come on, all this naked woman coming in on you. He said, well, put on your clothes. Talk to me, talk to me. Talk to me, you know. <laughs> A woman naked man. Come on. Bishop, they can't take it. Bishop, take the mic. Uh, come on. Because uh, listen, I have to be real. No matter who fight, they're going to lose. Because the same thing they fight, the vision is over. Go hit them 3 a.m. 
Come on, man of God. They can't bring that to you. Tell him, get away. They get away. But he's going to come with something. He's coming with something. He's coming with your thin thread. He's coming with something you struggle with. He come, come on, come on. We all want to be healthy. He's going to come with something that's going to make you healthy. Make you happy. Make you have money. Make you have a nice time. Are you there? That's what's coming. They were so stupid. The last one they brought, kill, destroy, maim. Come on, ma. damage. Come on, kill young people. Come on, but be ready for the next strong man coming. Stand up on your feet. Be ready for the next strong man. My God, be careful. My God, are oh, you try to damage? Who can recognize strong man? Jeremiah, Jeremiah nine verse twelve. God always have a man. That's what the man of God preaching on my television. God always have a man who design. <laughs> Get me Jeremiah 9 verse 12 somebody. God always have a man and a woman. Reckless people. Come on. Try to cancel. Come on. A man or a woman who will see what is coming. Reckless, worthless people. You got the verse for me? He said, who is the wise man? That's what he preached about a man for the strong man. Who is the wise man that may understand this? My God. It's in the Bible. That's in the Bible. I mean, everybody won't get it one time. Or in time. And who is he to whom the mouth of the Lord has spoken. God, how does it come on you? Come on. And a woman of God and man of God don't get it. Come on, come on. Did you hear what I said? See, that, that's, that's why you have to go to a prophetic church. Amos 3, 7. Say, nothing will happen, man of God, unless God reveal it. My God. Put up Amos 3, verse 7. <laughs> Oh, Bronneke Shaka Bahanda, Shirota Mahanda Bahanda. My God, Amos 3 verse 7. Somebody read it for me. My God, oh, they got it. They got it. He says, Surely, somebody says, Surely. Come on, talk to me, church, because it's three, it's five hours of sermon in me right now. I don't care about you. you have to preach to the world. Come on, somebody. Hey, hey, surely the Lord God will do nothing, no matter what. They come in a second time with. Just go to church. Get her to church. Get her in the house of God. Get her in a prophetic church. Get her in a proven prophetic church. Be careful where you go. Be careful that those who fight against a prophetic church. A man, of, a man of God told, oh, let me finish this one, I won't preach. Surely the Lord will do nothing, but he reveal it is secret. Are you there? It's secret now. People don't know about it, but it's coming. My God, unto his servants, the prophets. Two king call, they want to go to war. And one of the smart kings said, no, we're not going to war without your call. A man who's supposed to know what's going to happen. And they called the man, one king said, I don't like him. Come on, I hate him, I don't like what he, what he prophesied. But the other king said, go get him. Yes. And when they go get him, and they asked him, what's going to happen with the war? The man said, you're going to lose the war. Oh, Makasha. The king got upset and said, put him in jail because he said, we're going to lose the war. And the man of God said to him, my God, go to war now, go ahead. If you come back, I'm not a prophet. If you come back from that war, I am not a prophet. <laughs> What's them folks who thumb in their nose? At God, thumb in their nose at the move of God, thumb in their nose. <laughs> oh, oh. 
before this wicked thing did i tell you to stand sit back down come on somebody i don't know what went wrong with me come on somebody glory to god before this thing happened in 2020 this wicked thing 2021 in february of 21 god showed everything come on god show a tiny man anybody remember the, Reve the tiny man revelation god show a tiny man <laughs> my god having control <laughs> around full grown men and women in revelation when you see a tiny man or a baby it means demon <laughs> God, no, no adult can be so small come on because they have to be subtle come on they have to be sly they have to look harmless my god my god my god god show it all my god and you were one from the revelation it's all online it's all online my god and they are coming again they're coming again. You're one. But praise God. You have ha, the knowledge before it comes. Stand up again. Stand up again. Stand up again. Vladimir, let me pray for you because you never come up. Like when you just get saved, Vladimir, you need another prayer. You know? Anytime they call for prayer, come and say, Pastor, pray for me. You know, hear what he wants to say. You see, he just say to me, Pastor, pray for me. <laughs> my god father in your hand right now i please vladimir i rebuke every strong man every attack of the devil everything the devil tried to come after him since he get saved and get baptized see it and lose him lose him right now in the name of jesus and i minister deliverance to him right now deliverance to him right now i break every wall off his life and i said i'm free by the blood Somebody say in Jesus' name. I want to do more. It's a lot in me. If you leave me alone, I have one year of revival right here. Hey, I make mistake and say it in Florida. Come on. And they listen to me. Come on, somebody. And they went for three years. And still going. They've gone about three years and two months now. Every day. <laughs> Come on. Okay. I always tell them, I always say, you young men, you don't know about church. One day per week, two days per week, that's worthless to be a man of God. So I always attack them. I say, you young men, that I'm, I'm, that I'm old already. <laughs> so hear me, you young men, if I was young like you, I'd have church every day for a year. <laughs> I thought they couldn't do it. When I look, it's the young people started. <laughs> you think it's old people? It's something where I stopped. Something hit me. But God said, You see, young people, beware of the old prophet spirit. I see the old prophet spirit going around some young men of God, women of God who call God hand upon them. I'm an old man, so I can't speak. I'm not trying to, I'm, come on, some now. I'm not trying to target old men right now. I'm an old man too. Come on, somebody, are you there? But, they, but there is a there is an old spirit, old prophet spirit that's targeting some men of God, who men of God, who God touched, who God gifted, and because you're a respecter of persons, you are listening to them. Be on leadership, and you're gonna get damaged. So I'm going to get damaged already. I, I, I was over there and the Holy Ghost hit me and said, no, 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 no. You can't go without, without speaking it. Young people, what God has touch. Careful who travel with you. Careful who you travel with. Careful as you get in their presence, what they said to you. If they said to you anything about those over you, tell them, I'm sorry. I take a pass. I still got to be got to be courteous because he's an old man an old woman the devil is using it hard right now some some young people I see God and upon them they're so powerful some can sing so good preach so good teach so good have the ministry of deliverance to 
great strong world and some world prophet my god some world prophet spirit come upon them my god and i chop them cause them to miss their way and right now they are think they are they are okay and they are not okay anybody who boycott come on this dominion revival is not okay i tell you i don't like take the mic i don't like take the mic come on tell them get themselves together my god you can't boycott what god called Anybody was here Saturday night? Yeah. Come on, the Saturday night alive. Anybody was here? Come on, somebody. You cannot boycott that and be fine. You have to be delivered. No matter who you are, be delivered. My God. There's so much in my belly, but I'm closing my Bible. And my... <laughs>